Hey friends. So today we're going to do rock cleaning. So I have our tray all set up for everything that we're gonna need. I have a sponge, a toothbrush. If you don't have an extra toothbrush at home to use, you can substitute with toothpicks, or not toothpicks, Q-tips. I went out to the rock playground and grabbed a few dirty rocks for us to clean. And then I have a bowl of soapy water. And then over to the side, I have an extra bowl to put our rocks in when they are clean. So the first thing we're going to do is grab one of our dirty rocks and place it into our bubbly water. I'm just gonna let that sit in there for a couple seconds. Trying to keep us in frame. I have a block holding us up so we have a better shot. And I'm gonna take our toothbrush and just start scrubbing our rock. Okay, it looks pretty clean. I'm just gonna take our sponge we have and dab the extra water off of our rock. And I'm gonna place it in this extra bowl. And we're just gonna do it again. So put our rock in the bowl. You're going to be amazed at how much dirt is going to come off of your rocks in your bowl of soapy water. That one looks pretty good. I'm going to dab it to get the extra water off. Then I'm gonna also take that same sponge if I see I'm dripping any water on the tray and wipe up any drips and drops. I don't know if you can kind of see the dirt floating around in the bowl, but that's all the dirt that we got off of those few rocks. And then when you finish this work, the following day, if you want, you can use your clean rocks that you have now for tweezing and that'll be a way that you can use the same materials for a next day item on our list. I hope this was a helpful lesson.